This one's on you. Today we're going to talk about how to hold and set hard bargains with your attorneys. Your attorneys are giving you a goal, a project, something to take and lead. And so often I'm hearing from team members, well, they're not getting their work done. Well, they empowered me to make the decision on X, Y, and Z, and then they completely kicked me in the teeth on this one and negated everything that I said after doing the hard research and said, no, we're going to do it this way. If this kind of behavior is occurring in your law firm and you're rolling over or you're resenting or you're throwing your hands up and saying, why bother with your attorney? It's on you. It's on you that you're accepting this behavior. This week in law firm admin bootcamp, it came up. My attorney's not doing their, getting their work done. And or I came in today and thought my plan was going to look like X, Y, and Z. And my attorney had, you know, an extra shot of espresso and came in at 6 a.m. and finally started dealing with the three files that have been sitting on their desk. And now they're buzzing me to come in because they have some gas in their tank about this. And I go in there and they just, they just derailed my day. I'm like, no, they didn't derail your day. Number one, you broke the process. Attorneys should not have files sitting in their office. So you asked for it. If you put these, allowed these files to be sitting in their office. And we had a phenomenal conversation because a paralegal, the associate attorney and the client service coordinator were on open coaching and growing hours this week. And they all had the same complaint. You all know it. You've seen it before. Your attorney gets a, a rush of adrenaline and they come in and now finally they're able to tackle X, Y, and Z that they've been putting off. But guess what? You're the beneficiary of those files and they come back to you and or they're going to buzz you to come in and ask you 10 million questions about it because it's been two, four, six weeks or months since they handled the file. So you're not a victim to this behavior and they're not derailing your day. It's really anchoring you back to going to the process of, okay, how the files get on their desk in the first place. So why were they not on the case management report? Why weren't time scheduled in the attorney's calendar and mine to sit with them to touch this once? So this is actually a gift and it's time to hold the hard bargains when your attorney's buzzing you and say, no, I'm working. These are my top three for the day. Another thing that we identified is they were no longer having the daily huddles to clarify and verify the top three for the day and getting clear on what the attorney has. So hold your attorney's feet to their dream sometimes in spite of themselves. If you're feeling resentful based on their behavior, go back and look at where you're abandoning your daily huddles, where you're abandoning your weekly case review meetings, where you're allowing files to sit in their office, where you're allowing for them to buzz you and interrupt you, and you're actually saying, yes, it's time to hold these hard bargains with your attorney, which a bargain is an agreement between the two of us, between two or more people. So we set these rules and attorneys are constantly talking about system and process till the cows come home. I see them all over chasing information, chasing uh, conferences and things that nature when it comes to SOPs and process and production, what have you. So remind them of what the payoff is. Remind them what's at stake. Remind them where they're out of integrity if they're trying to violate this and what the cause and effect is. So employees... You're no longer a victim. If you're allowing this behavior and you're resentful for this behavior, get on my calendar. Or attorneys, if you're finding that your attorney, your team members are allowing this behavior, get together, grab a cup of coffee, get on my calendar, and let's stop this immediately and come up with our new ground rules.